Welcome to Food Fights, and today we're going to be trying these two brands of canned mushrooms. On the left, weighing in at four ounces, is Pennsylvania Dutchman Pieces and Stems Mushrooms. And on the right, also weighing in at four ounces, is Great Values Mushroom Pieces and Stems. I love mushrooms. I put mushrooms in a lot of dishes I have at home. Of course, spaghetti, pizza, beef stroganoff, among other things that I can't think of right now, but I just love mushrooms. I mean, mushrooms or mushrooms, how much of a difference is there going to be between the Pennsylvania Dutchman and the Walmart Great Value brand of mushrooms? I'm sure there can be a difference maybe in the size of the pieces and the quality of the pieces, but hey, they're doggone mushrooms. How much difference can there be? So for the Pennsylvania Dutchman, I paid 84 cents for this four ounce can and that works out to 21 cents an ounce. For the Walmart Great Value brand, I paid 57 cents also for this four ounce can and that works out to 14 cents an ounce. So obviously, just based on price, the Great Value brand is the better value in this instance. But that's only if these things are as good as they look on the picture. But I'm not sure if they do. So let's open these up and see if there is a difference between these two. And on the surface, both these pull tabs, they look identical. Everything about this can is identical. To the point, kind of wonder if these were both packed in the same mushroom factory. I don't know. So let's look at ingredients and see if there's anything hidden in here. Uh, mushrooms, water, salt, and I don't expect anything different on the Great Value brand. What do we have here? May contain traces of milk, wheat, or soy. Well, the other one didn't say that, did it? Mushrooms, water, and salt, exactly the same stuff. So I really don't expect a difference in taste of these at all, but the only difference I can expect is maybe the, the size of the pieces, the shapes, I don't know, maybe the irregular pieces, because that's really what these are. These are not your premium, these are what I almost always buy, just the pieces and stems. So let's open these up and see what they look like. And that looks like a can of mushrooms. All right, let's try the Walmart Great Value brand to see what this looks like. And that, too, looks like a can of mushrooms. Do any one of these look any better than the other? I mean, I'm seeing mostly stems in there just right off the bat. And in the Walmart, it looks like we got more like whole mushrooms that are sliced up. So just from looking at them, right now the Walmart looked better than the Pennsylvania Dutch. So let's randomly scoop some of these out of here and just see what we get. So here's a fork load of the Pennsylvania Dutch. And here's a fork load of... The Walmart. I saw this big one there. Look at that. There's a giant one in there. I love mushrooms. And the bigger, the better. Look at that. That is really nice. So right off the bat, just like I said, it looks like the Walmart has better chunks of mushrooms in there than the Pennsylvania Dutch. But as always, what's most important is how these things taste. I'm going to grab a piece of a stem there. So let's try the Pennsylvania Dutch and see how this tastes. Mmm. Tastes like mushrooms. Mmm. Nice, nice firm texture, just the right amount of salt. Oh, tastes like mushrooms. That is really good. I love mushrooms, obviously. All right, so now let's try the Walmart Great Value brand. And uh, I don't see a stem. I should grab a stem to give it a fair comparison. Uh, that is, there's a stem, almost identical to what I did out of the Pennsylvania Dutch. So here's a stem from the Walmart brand. Let's try this. Mmm, actually... Seemed like I got a bit more mushroom flavor out of that. Why that would be, I don't know. Maybe just that particular mushroom. Maybe the preparation is a little bit different. Maybe they have cooked or washed more of the flavor out of the Pennsylvania Dutch. I don't know. So let's try this again. Let's try the Pennsylvania Dutch. Now we're going to use a cap. We're going to use a piece of the cap from the mushroom. Let's see how this tastes from the Pennsylvania Dutch. Mmm. Wow. Real good texture. Mmm. Very good texture. All right. Let's try this cap from the Walmart brand and let's see how this is. Mm. I'm surprised. Wow. I am really surprised. Very good texture. Very good flavor. That is really interesting. I don't want to dump these. I'm going to spill water all over the place. But both of these are very, very good. And there is a winner here. Pennsylvania Dutch, obviously more expensive. The Walmart Great Value is a great value. But when I look at the mushrooms, I like the size and the cut of the mushrooms in the Walmart much better than I do the Pennsylvania Dutch. And also, I like... The flavor, actually the flavor of the Walmart tasted better than the Pennsylvania Dutch. It seemed like these had a bit more of a mushroom flavor. Maybe they just weren't washed as much, or maybe just the breed or just the type of mushroom or just the season was a little bit different, which caused us to have a better and a more of a mushroom flavor. 
but the best thing is the price. So in this instance, the Walmart Great Value brand was definitely the great value. So the winner in this video is the Walmart Great Value brand of mushrooms. So thank you for watching Food Fights and please subscribe so we can continue to try it before you buy it. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.